Hi, my name is Dr. Rob Mordkin, and I am the U.S. Medical Director for Let's Get Checked. And today we're going to talk briefly about colorectal cancer. Approximately 1.8 million cases of colon cancer will be diagnosed this year worldwide, uh, perhaps as many as 140,000 of those in the United States alone. So what is colorectal cancer or colon cancer? Well, this is cancer that forms uh, from the cells that line our intestines, most notably our large intestines or our colon. And this includes the lower part of the colon, also known as the rectum. What are the signs and symptoms of colorectal cancer? These can be difficult and somewhat vague, and it's why screening is so important. But some signs could be things like blood in the stool or dark or tarry stools, change in bowel habits, um, perhaps difficulty with bowel movements, abdominal pain or abdominal bloating, uh, maybe unexplained weight loss. Who should get tested for colorectal cancer? Well, general recommendations now are that everybody should have screening, certainly probably by the age of 50 or so. But there are some groups that absolutely need to be screened and probably need to be screened even earlier or at a younger age. Uh, certainly if you had any of the signs or symptoms that I mentioned earlier, um, particularly blood in the stool would be at the top of the list, then getting checked sooner rather than later would be a great idea. But if there's a family history of colon cancer or a personal or family history of colon polyps, uh, this group of patients should absolutely uh, be seeking a regular evaluation and screening. Is there good news about colon cancer? Well, there is good news about colon cancer. And I think the take home message should be that if it's detected early, there's absolutely an excellent chance of long-term cure, which further highlights the importance of getting screened, getting checked, and being monitored for a disease that's very prevalent. So how does one actually get tested for colon cancer? Well, one option certainly would be some of these emerging uh, tests that are available on a stool sample. Uh, these have come out in the last several years and have been very helpful. And uh, absolutely another major, major mainstay to testing is colonoscopy, which is a test that is usually performed by a medical specialist called a GI doctor or gastroenterologist. But if you have any symptoms or concerns about colon cancer yourself, then I strongly encourage you to talk with your primary care doctor, talk with a, a gastroenterologist if you have access to one, and you can always come to letsgetchecked.com and uh, be in contact with one of the members of our nursing team, either through a live chat option or through direct telephone contact.